মন্ত্রী কথনা আট সালকাল ছলং আহারংকার উ এম এল এ কথায় নুব সন বর সুলাই হিনিকি ক্লাবু ইউমো নংরিম বন্তে কাতাগর কালচার কমপ্লেক্স হারিল বং কাজিংবু ইউমো নংরিম কলং রু শিবন্দা কুম কজিং আই সুন ভাসি খা জক সরকার এম ডি এ টু কবা মনটা কী কারখে কলংখু সি ডাবি স্নাম জং কজিং সার ইয়া কজলা
our MBA to government. So in a way, this is MBA's birthday gift to the state of Mayra, and especially to Tagore's fans and followers. Just a month back, on the 6th of, 16th of February, it was with sheer delight and pleasure that with the active support of the Indian High Commission in Dhaka, we had gone to unveil the bust and also inaugurate the Tirot Singh Library at Dhaka. A tribal chieftain from Nong Cloud has today become a global hero whose memory stands proud in the heart of Bangladesh. And we thought we would reciprocate by having the Tagore Cultural Complex here in Shillong. The place where, which had inspired Tagore to write three of his best known books, one of which I have get as a kid when I used to frequent the State Central Library and came across a slim volume of his short stories. And it is also a matter of pride that Shillong, with, with its small size, has given birth to so many classic works of art, books, music, poetry. When we make a mention of the legendary figures of the Bengali community, I'm delighted to share with you that it is not just Tagore who has visited and stayed in Shillong, but you also have Netaji Subhash Chandra Bose. I do not know how many of you would know this, but a friend of mine happens to possess a vintage jeep that was used to drive Netaji when he had come via Senet to Shillong. And that vintage car is today located at Ansville, Upper Shillong. A few years later, on the other part of Shillong, Khan had written and completed the Sivarim Uriyotra, his magnum opus, in 1936. Therefore, friends, Shillong is not just a name, a city, or an address. It is a hub of culture. It is an icon of civilization. When I read about Arun Nabi Roy, it gives me immense pleasure to know that she was also born in Shillong, Robert Hospital Jaina. Had she stayed on, she would have been my daughter. When we have a day like today, we celebrate the fact that life is not just about pursuing our careers, attending work. In fact, I'm delighted by the fact that we have a packed audience today in the working day. It means that all of you have chosen to be here away from the call of duty because deep down 
inside each one of us, there lives a dreamer, a boy, and a passionate lover of the arts. Beyond the world of beauty and beyond the confines of our office spaces. Friends, it is also a happy occasion for me to announce that this project we have organized today's foundation stay at the Soul Lake Ceremony with the sole intention of pursuing and actively commencing the project as well, Sandor has just highlighted. In fact, I'm thankful to my predecessors in the department, Bar Sandor Shulai, Bar ELA, and our Chief Minister, who have in the past pursued this matter actively with the powers that be in Delhi. And after I took over, we also made sure that we to come up with the required steward share in order for to enable this project to take off. We also have a very clear vision that this cultural complex, but when completed, will not only be will not only cater to those fans here in Shillong, but we would like to make it global, connect with Dhaka, connect with Western world to ensure that it is a vibrant cultural center filled with activities and programs. We would like to see the exchange of cultures and Robin Guru gives philosophy that someone should rise above his ethnic identity to become a global thinker and a global vision. Each one of you, especially in today's high-tech digital world, Please share with your friends across the world that Shillong has added another pearl to its geography, this cultural complex, which, as Asimbo has reminded us, this very complex houses a room that Tagore had used and also a bed he had slept in. I am sure that the brood for which brood site came to be born has also inspired him into lines of poetry and lights of his imagination. So once again I thank each one of you